everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a tour of our Airbnb in Maui, Hawaii. And I'm here with Brittany, one of my roommates here on this beautiful island. So we're just gonna show you around the Airbnb and kind of what it's like here. This Airbnb is not guaranteed to be an average Maui or Hawaii space. It's just our experience. It's a very specific Airbnb, but I thought it would be interesting to show you guys around. This is the closet where we keep all of our snorkeling stuff, extra blankets. They have tents and vacuums for us. They have, they provided um, actually beach chairs, like lawn chairs for us that we keep in our car um, and an umbrella and a cooler. So that's super nice. Um, so that's a little closet. This is our shoe area. <laughs> where we keep everything shoe related. Um, it's nice to have it right by the door because it gets sandy as heck um, when we come in from the beach and from basically any place that we go. Also, there's a sign, so we follow the sign. We follow the sign. It says, Aloha, please remove your... And then blank. But, you blank. know, you just have to infer. You know, mm -hmm. it takes really high level thinking to infer what that means. This big open common area, which is super super nice. Mm -hmm. um, we've got some seating over here, some beautiful books, some travel books, and um, this is Brittany's domain. Do you want to yes. show them around your domain? Yeah, I can show them around my domain. <laughs> All right. So here we have some lays. This is where we put the lays, and then this is where we lay down. This is my bedroom. Um, you get a lot of privacy here. We have this great curtain. Where you can just take it out, um, and it covers absolutely nothing. And then, <laughs> um, yeah, so this is where it ends up sleeping at night. It's actually a couch bed. So this is actually originally a couch. So if you don't have more people, obviously you could just keep that as a couch. Um, it's always made every single day, no matter what anyone tells you. It's definitely made every single day. <laughs> And this table is always clear. This table is always clear and clean. <laughs> wow. Um, yeah, we got a nice TV. We plug in our HDMI cord, watch different movies, different Disney movies. Mm -hmm. What are some of the movies we've watched? Brittany? We've watched Aladdin. We watched Agent Cody Banks, which oh, was like yes. something I did not remember that I remembered. <laughs> uh, yeah, and we just used this as our little comfy viewing bed, yes. couch, bed couch, couch bed. And then this table right over here is where we work and eat. So most important things are working and eating, obviously. Um, but yeah, Brittany and I did some work this morning, so we've got all our laptops and stuff here. But we also have nice dinners here and breakfast. Yeah, Isaac sometimes. is a chef. Isaac is a chef, yes. And the other day, Grace made me dinner, super nice. Yes. It's a good time. And yeah, so we're over here a lot. I feel like I'm always table. Um, all right, and then if we go over to the kitchen, we this is the we'll AC, see. the annoying constant whenever it's on. <laughs> oh yes, yeah, so we do have AC, which is really nice. Yeah, the only problem is it's one, super loud, two, super cold, and blows right where I sleep, and then also, like, blows the curtain. And we do get a lot of bugs, which we'll talk about momentarily. It's nice that we have an AC. Um, we are constantly turning this on and off, and they actually ask you to turn it on and off um, so that you're not using it all the time mm -hmm. when you leave. Please turn it off and on again. <laughs> um, but it's very loud, very cold, right where Brittany, sleep. <laughs> Brittany sleeps. Um, so we are very lucky to have an AC unit. A lot of Airbnbs and hotels. Don't yeah, the original Airbnb we were going to stay at did not have an air conditioning unit actually, so mm -hmm. we were very happy when we got this one. Yes. And we also have these louvered windows. Am I saying that right? Louvered windows. We'll just dub it. Um, and so um, these are really nice to let the air in. They're all over the Airbnb, um, so you can just open and close them here. And it doesn't necessarily seal the whole apartment up, so a lot of bugs do get in. Um, oh, there is a screen that helps. Yes, the screen definitely helps a lot. Unfortunately, there is no screen over here. <laughs> so when you get into the kitchen, there is this. We did have a problem with ants, but with a little bit of peppermint um, oil and essential. Treat, essential oil, we were able to get rid of them, which was super nice. Otherwise, if you leave food out on the counter, you're toast. <laughs> We've got stove, oven, 
dishwasher. Yeah, so they did provide us with some dish pods at the beginning. Um, and a lot of them don't work. <laughs> So we have been hand washing our dishes, which is totally fine as well. Got some nice cabinets, lots of space in here. And they provided some Tupperware and added some of our own. And they it's have a little bit messy and in here. But... Cups and mm -hmm. that. We're showing the reality. We're showing the reality. We also got some nice avocados over here. Freaking amazing. Some mangoes and potatoes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um, our pantry is stocked, mostly. We need to get a little bit more bread. We have a lot of snack foods, as you can see. A lot of peanut butter, because that's all I eat, and they've been eating it a lot, too. Peanut butter and bananas. That's mm -hmm. all she eats. Yes. Here is our fridge. <laughs> We've got lots in here. We try to eat at home as often as we can because eating out gets expensive and we would rather insert Vana here. <laughs> insert Vana. Vana, the story to be told. <laughs> this is what the open space looks like from this point of view. Common area. Let us join Brittany on the porch. Welcome. Aloha. Aloha. All right, this is our beautiful porch. We have a nice view of the pool um, and some beautiful plants out here. Um, we come out here a lot to eat or do some work. Um, it's a very beautiful place to just kind of get some fresh air. We don't have a beach view, but I believe our view is very beautiful with all these plants. Oh, we have some great patio furniture. We have some chairs, the table, it's all provided. We even have another chair that's a little bit overshadowed by the plants. <laughs> This plant is actually fake, so, just like you know, thing. we don't have to water it, but it gives a vibe, but we love these real plants over here. Mm -hmm. This is our AC that comes on out here. It used to leak, but we fixed it up, so that's great. And we got these cute little turtles. Yeah, this is our version of Turtle Town. We got those, and then we have turtles at the bottom of that pool. <laughs> and a turtle right over there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, let's go back inside to see the rest of the Airbnb. And we'll go ahead and take you over to our bathroom. All right, so this is our bathroom. The fan turns on every time the light turns on, so I'm very sorry if it gets loud. Um, this is our shower and our sink. Pretty standard here. And then we have the most beautiful thing in the apartment and a mirror. This fan it's an stays fan. on all the time as soon as you... Is it just when you turn on the light or just all the time? No, it's all the time. The fan just stays on. It's a very dedicated fan. Very avid one. Alright, and then we got our little hallway closet right over here. This just stores some extra towels, toilet paper, cleaning supplies, that type of thing. And this is our one and only actual separated bedroom here. Um, and Isaac and I sleep here, but we all use this space to keep some clothes. We've got a lot of drawers and closet space here, so that's super nice. This is always a little bit messy. <laughs> um, I keep a lot of our sunscreen and my makeup in purse and things like that. Some masks. Um, got some camera stuff here for our little vlogs and um, we all have different um, drawer spaces in the dresser. Keep my hat right here for easy access. Um, we've got a few fans in here because this room does get a little bit extra hot since the AC doesn't quite reach it. So we try to um, bring the cool AC in through that fan but um, yeah. And then over here, this is where Isaac 
actually worked at the beginning of the trip. He worked for a week before he used a little bit of PTO at the end. Um, so he would wake up every morning at 4 a.m. and work right here. So props to him for, for doing that. Um, over here we've got our closet. It's not very organized, but we have it here. We have some dirty clothes, just different things that need to be hung, extra towels and blankets. And we've got more storage space over here with the bedside tables. Love staying here. We're in Kihei, um, which is more of a residential area. We really it's recommend been, staying here. It's been very nice, especially because like the weather here I also feel like is nicer. I don't know if that's a real thing, but it feels <laughs> nice. It feels nicer, yeah. When we went over to Lahaina, which is where a lot of people stay when they're visiting, um, it just seemed very, very hot, but we also went in the middle of the day, so I don't yeah. know. It's also a lot more crowded in Lahaina versus here. That's very true. Um, so we feel like we got a pretty good deal with this Airbnb staying in Kihei and it's a wonderful place to stay. We are walking distance to Charlie Beach. This is a beautiful beach, my favorite beach on the island, other than the Slaughterhouse Beach, which is pretty nice. Yeah, it was pretty, it's pretty good. Um, but I also even got a painting actually when we went to a fruit farm. I ended up purchasing a painting of Charlie on the Beach by mm -hmm. um, Rebecca Lowell. So shout out to her. Mm -hmm. Check her out. There's a lot of beautiful artists here on Hawaii and um, definitely support them if you want to go over to Lahaina. The other thing that's nice about Kihei is it's a great driving distance from a lot of different places. Like I feel like if you stay on one side of the island or the other, it might be a far driving distance, but I feel like it's normally about an hour mm -hmm. everywhere we drive. Mm -hmm. Sometimes if we're going, like Road to Han is about two hours. Um, uh, and then like Costco, Walmart, that type of thing is about a half hour away. Mm -hmm. So it's a really great location. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I post about one to two times a week here on this channel. Um, also make sure to go su subscribe to Brittany. She'll be coming out with a few Hawaii vlogs and she has a lot of Disney vlogs as well over on her channel. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed and we will talk to you guys next time. Bye! Bye. It's like slightly in a new hole. I won't be like this, so I'm straight. But we're but not guess, straight. Yeah, in reality, it, it really works there. What is this position? <laughs> this is my happily ever after Looks position. like you're an aerial. The evening star. Watch this, I might cry though. Honestly. Be the Polynesian one. Oh, yes. just for the for the iconic meme of it. I don't know if that's a meme. We got this lay at the Polynesian at Disney World. Mm -hmm. They were giving them out for free, and Brittany's gonna be crowned today. Are you prepared, Brittany? Am I also being knighted? Yes. Okay. Not prepared. How to double check? How do you feel? 
Chivalrous. <laughs> she feels chivalrous. <laughs> All right. <laughs>